N8N versus Make versus Zapier 2025 Honest Review. In this video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be talking about three of the greatest automation softwares that are out there that help you with your workflow automation. And we're going to be talking about which one of these are better than each other. So Make and Zapier, as we all know, are two of the most popular automation platforms. And with their help, you can connect various apps and services and create powerful workflows. Now, in this video, I'm going to provide an in-depth comparison of Make versus Zapier, focusing on key aspects such as pricing integration, user management, API capabilities, error handling, scalability, AI automation, and others. And obviously, we're going to be talking about N8N as well, which is a source available workflow automation tool that really kicks off with these two tools. Now, although Make Zapier offers similar functionality, there are distinct differences that may make one of these three better suited to your needs than the other. Now, Zapier is a good starting point for non-tech users who are exploring automation. Make is more robust for building advanced scenarios for yourself. And N8N is even more advanced for the people who are more developed in code, IT, and more. Now, first of all, let's talk about the key concepts. So when it comes to the pricings, N8N charges only per workflow execution. So if you come over to its pricing, you can see that it does have plans, but for each workflow execution you have, it's going to price you for that. Make, on the other hand, if we come over to the pricing, we can see that make is going to charge per individual operation that you pull off. And the same goes for Zapier. So you know, you can check these pricings out on their very own website if you want to. We have free professional team and enterprise plan for Zapier as well. So I'd say Make and Zapier have similar pricings and N8N is slightly different. Then you also get pre-built connectors for all three of these. So Make has around 1,500 plus pre-built connectors. Zapier has 6,000 plus and N8N offers 1,000 plus, which require additional credential setups. Now, all three platforms allow you to make custom requests, but N8N has a much easier way to do this for yourself. So compared to Zapier, Make is going to have more robust error handling, collaboration, and user management features, especially on higher tier plans. N8N, on the other hand, supports basic team management on paid tiers and extended functionality on the enterprise plan. Make is more suited for complex workflows and high data volumes. Zapier is much easier to expand but has limitations in customization and handling complex workflows and N8N has unique nodes for data transformations and allows the creation of highly flexible workflows with multiple triggers. Now when it comes to the coding part of it, both Make and Zapier impose significantly limited custom scripting while N8N could be much more attractive to the developers. So all three of these platforms work pretty incredibly for their pricing as well as the features that they provide us. And, you know, it, in the end, it depends on you on whichever you want to use. So I've thoroughly compared Make Zapier and N8N as a powerful automation platform with their own strengths and weaknesses. I'd say N8N emerges as a compelling alternative for both of these, especially for users who value cost effectiveness, robust workflow building experience, and developer friendly features. So the choice of platform depends on various factors, including the complexity of your automations, the integrations you require, and the initial skills of your team and your budget. So according to that, do go ahead and, you know, give it some thought, give it some idea on whichever you want to go with. And obviously, according to that, that will be your platform. So that's pretty much all there is for me. Now, if you enjoyed this video, drop down a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'm going to be seeing all of you in the very next video. Have a great and amazing day. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.